For Albert John A.J. Mappa and his missionary companions, Saturday was supposed to be a fun day out on the Provo River. They didn't think it would be the last time they would ever see him. Everything went wrong so fast. Every time I close my eyes, I see that river and it scares me. Investigators say Mappa jumped off a bridge but never resurfaced. Search and rescue crews found his body more than three hours later. And when he jumped and he just said, I love you, everyone. And um, I think that's the message that he wants to leave them. The news is still hard to process for Mappa's friends and family, who say he just returned from his mission in Tonga nine months ago. They say he impacted many people's lives and always knew how to put a smile on their face. He was always the life of the party. He brought the light to everybody. And I feel like that's pretty much what he was known for. His girlfriend says he had big plans for the future, possibly a college degree in engineering and starting a family. Marriage was definitely a talk. Marriage was definitely uh, being discussed. His loved ones attribute his selfless, motivated, and outgoing personality to his mother, who says, I'm proud to say that I was his mother for 21 years. As they prepare to lay him to rest, they say they find solace, knowing he's looking down on them from above. He was here for a short time on this earth. But if anybody lived a full, happy life, it was that man. Reporting in West Valley City, Rosie Nguyen, ABC4 News.